What do you think about killing? Killing to me is like a movie. I spend all night thinking about it. I want to write it, produce it, direct it, act in it, and well, make it happen. No matter what. Oh, as you were saying? I think I'm possessed. I've talked to religious folks about it. I have this demon. The demon in the driver's seat. Well, it's a cold day out there, folks. With snow proceeding over the night, Temperatures ranging from 20 to 25 below zero. Nothing new to report on missing teenager Anna Smith. She was last seen near Newport Grill one week ago. A local man Dennis Rito. witnessed Anna talking to a man in dark sunglasses around 9 p.m. in the Newport Grill parking lot. Anyone who has further info, please call in. Anna will sure be praying for you out there, and thanks for keeping a watchful eye. Mr. Radar, this town needs more like you. Hey, Dennis. Getting kind of cold out here, huh? Yes, that is accurate. Yeah, I heard you got a bouncy baby on the way. Right? Congratulations, man. Hmm, yes. A happy 77 it will be indeed. I notice your grass is a little out of whack. Yeah, um, you know, the winter's killing the lawn off, so I really much you can do, right? Do I look like a dumb cunt, son? What? Do I look like a dumb C U N T? I don't really know what to say right now? <laughs> I may be your friend, but I will not ignore my official duties. But, yeah, man, but like, I get that, and I always keep my yard nice. Can't I just get that next time? Not today, you didn't. And what will it be next time? Oh no, I forgot to put the Drano away, so baby Holly don't drink it and die. But no worries, honey. I'll get to it next time. You don't even know how much I strive and work for this community. I'm trying to do my job, my officer duty. Dennis, uh, aren't you just a compliance officer for our neighborhood? I mean, you're not really a police. I'm gonna go ahead and take care of that grass here shortly. Does that keep the peace, Dennis? What if your wife was raped? What if little Holly got stabbed before her first tooth came in? What if someone much stronger than yourself... came in and bound you, tortured you, and finally, killed you. I bet that you would want, nay, need my arm of the law then. And wash your car, Brian!
sandwich. I wanted to go over what we'll be doing tonight. I think we can get creative. So I got you something. A gift? No! Don't thank me yet. You don't even know what it is. Do you like it? Please, mister. I need to go home now. Complain, complain, complain. What the flying friend is wrong with you? I bought you something, you little Debbie Downer. I made you food! I have given you shelter! And all I hear every day, every day, is, Oh, mister, let me go! What do I have to do to get you to show some gratitude, Debbie? You kidnapped me and kept me down here for days now! Ah! <laughs> Are you ready to eat yet? Yes. Thank you, mister. Officer will do. Unless you want to call me BTK. That'd be fine by me, little missy. BTK? What is that? Well, I figure it's my name. A calling card. Like Jack the Ripper. My serial killer name. You've given this some thought? Yeah. I more or less know what I am. And what are you? Well, I'm made of many things. A family man. An officer of the law. But overall, a hunter. With such yummy prey, I might add. I have this thing. I call it Factor X. Albert Fish, Ed Gein, Charles Manson, they all have it too. This thing that makes us do these wackadoo acts. I mean, normal people just don't get hard at the thought of ending a life. Really putting your hands around someone's throat. Applying the right pressure, steady now. Squeeze. Squeeze until the very life itself is gone forever. Now <laughs> here comes your tuna. Thank you, BTK. <laughs> See, was it that hard to be nice? Jeez Louise. I mean, the world is so cold, so cruel already. It's just wise to be nice, especially to people who are nice to you, like a certain someone. Now, you've got some food in you. Did you want to smoke, or maybe even alcoholic beverage, maybe? I don't drink myself. I find it dulls the senses. But I do keep a pack or two in the fridge, just in case for company. That's pretty nice of me, isn't it, 27? What did you call me? You don't even know. Well, you might find this interesting, but you are number 27 that I'm currently working on. You're my latest project. Why would a girl like you cry? Because I'm an innocent human! I don't deserve this! Number 27, you have 12 unpaid parking tickets. Each a grand total of $25. 300 bucks you owe to our U.S. government. And worst of all, you still have your boyfriend. I warned you to get rid of him! Paul? What does Paul have to do? 
to do with any of this? Well, Anna, Debbie Downer, little missy, it's just so unclean of you to be living with a guy when you're not even married. That's just not right. What? <laughs> Fucking Jesus freak. I'm sorry. What was that? Jesus freak. If you ever, ever speak ill of the gunboard again, I will bring Paul here and I'll have him watch as I fuck you in the eye socket over and over again! I think we'll get on with it. No sense in wasting anybody's time. Please. BGK, let me go. I won't tell anyone. And you can even do those things you like again. You can tie me up. And I can tie you up. Please, just let me go after. And God heard his weeping child and simply said, no. they can pick up right where I left off. In fact, I'm not the first one he has recruited. And hell, someday, in my very own house, years from now, there will be, oh man, just an amazing killer. An angel of sleep, if you will. Big plans there. And two, being that the security guard only checks on me every 30 minutes when I'm with a guest. It's been about 15 minutes, give or take. Meaning we have another 15 minutes to play. Oh, 22, why didn't you appear? Twas impeccable, of amber and delight, so dotty on that midwinter's night. My inner feeling brimmed with expectancy of the avarice season. Wham! Blithe with mortality and rapture, a lush entwine like new vines in the night. Oh, 22, why didn't you appear? Fresh-cut, glistening dew, crawling down your nakedness to scent to enchanted blooms, daggering within. In a landfill of yearning, regret, rapture, and woe, this game is one with which the devil snows. Reverie springs to a roaring tempest, winter ash referring the month. Oh, 22. 
Why did you not appear? I will bring you sexual death in time, my dear. <laughs> May you not be the unlucky one. With love, B.T.K. Okay.